Hey guys, how's it going? So there was some big, big news with Pymont Lithium Corporation Limited. Uh, it's up $27 this morning, 2.4536%. Why? Because it signed a deal with Tesla. Australia's Pymont signed a lithium oil supply deal with Tesla. So shares surge uh, Pymont. On Monday, has said it signed a five-year deal with Tesla to supply high-purity lithium oil to the U.S. electric car maker, prompting an 83% surge in Australian lithium miner shares. The initial five-year agreement implies Piedmont will supply about a third of its planned 160,000 tons per year of sodium concentrated produced from uh, its deposit in North Carolina. Both companies have an option to extend the deal for another five years. Shares of Australian miners touched the highest since May 2007. So big deal. You guys can read the rest of the article yourself. But very very big deal for Piedmont. And it's also helping with other lithium companies this morning. The share structure on this is extremely tight. There's only 11.55 million shares with a float of 7.67 million. So there is potential that this company could sometime in the future be worth a billion dollars, which would value the stock at a hundred dollars per share. Uh, it, you know what I found so, uh, something strange. If we look on on the Piedmont, we look on the Australia market. It's traded under twenty seven point five cents. It has a much bigger share structure. It has a total share of a uh, float of sixty point nine four and a total outstanding of one point one six billion shares, which is kind of weird. Because I would imagine that the U.S. and the uh, Australia's would be similar to each other, but it's not, which is very strange to me. It feels like they IPO'd on another exchange on under a different symbol, but it's very exciting. Uh, we'll see what happens. I may even make a position if this thing goes down significantly throughout the day. We'll see what happens. Uh, Lithium America Corporation bounced from this news and is falling. Neo Lithium also bounced on this news and is up 72 cents. Giga Metals is uh, also up this morning on this news of 8 cents, uh, 73 cents. Canadian Nickel Mining Company is uh, uh, bouncing on this news up 6 cents. FPX nickel this morning is also up two cents, so it's popping all nickel and lithium car corporation car uh, companies this morning. So nickel is up seven uh, zero point seven five cents this morning. We'll see if this can continue. Uh, it looks like nickel is starting to bounce a little bit, but we'll see if this is strength or weakness. So the market today is green, 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 green. Uh, very, very bright and happy days for the market at the moment. So we'll see if this game will continue. Uh, the market crash might be over because, you know, we'll see what happens. But it looks like the market crash could be, o uh, be over when you look on the SPY. The Tesla is up $15 this morning. Uh, Neo Lithium is up 62 cents this morning. Solo Electroma is up 4 cents this morning. Uh, DPHC is up $1.72 cents this morning, 7.18%. Arca Moto this morning up 9 cents. Oh, yeah, let's look at the spy real quick here. See what the spy is doing doing the spy so the spy is up this morning four dollars if we look from a charting perspective the spy looks like it's about to reverse and, go, and the macd it looks like it's about to go up and the 
price action is about to go up. But, you know, this could be a fake breakout and, you know, tomorrow the stock could crash back down and make further new lows. So definitely be careful, but if this MACD crosses, that is bullish and the stock market is going higher. We'll see if that's the scenario. Looks good right now, but I still put caution on it. Uh, so DHPC this morning is up a dollar fifty six. Arkamoto is up sixteen cents. DraftKings this morning is up a dollar oh six. Uh, Lancadian Holdings up twenty five cents this morning. Blink. Is up massively this morning, but it's pulling back. SBE Switchback Energy it was up massively this morning, but it's also pulling back a little bit. PIC this morning is up 29 cents. Trine this morning is up 12 cents, 1.08 percent. Hennessy Capital Acquisition Corp is down this morning, six cents. I don't own a position. GameStop this morning is extremely volatile, and now it's in the negative. It's down 21 cents, but it's trading very volatile. Could be an up, like I said, big pullback could be an opportunity to buy in. I am very bullish on this company. Um, ACB this morning is down at 18 cents. Must hurt for bank holders. Canopy growth this morning up 9 cents. What is APHA doing this morning? APHA is up 8 cents this morning. Uh, Cron. Cron, uh, Cron is up 5.3 cents this morning. Planet 13 is uh, up 16 cents this morning. Liberal Health Science is neutral this morning. True Eve is up 4 cents this morning. Kira is down up 8 cents this morning. Cresco Labs is up 9 cents this morning. And that is it for the video. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, subscribe for future updates and I hope this is at least 8 minutes in a few seconds. Uh, yes. And 5 more seconds. 4, 3, 2, 1. Anyways, bye.